Sean Rosalie Furler from the Sunshine Coast, Queensland, Australia. Hey, welcome to another great day down here. And welcome to Church on the Beach. Today, why Church on the Beach? Church on the Beach has been born out of a real desire to help people. Yes, people like you. And to continue to fulfill the call of God that's over our lives. We live in such a beautiful location here in Queensland. On one side of us we have the river, the Malula River, and on the other side we have the beautiful ocean, the Pacific Ocean. And also let the heavens declare the glory of God morning by morning. For day after day creation utters speech. The Apostle Paul says in the book of Philippians chapter 1 and verse 18, that in every way and by every means we should proclaim the gospel, that is, the good news of the Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus said in Matthew chapter 24, verse 14, And this gospel of the kingdom will be preached in all the world as a witness to all nations, and then shall the end come. So Rosalie and I believe that we have a mandate from God to declare the good news of the gospel in every way and by every means. Recently we did a series called What Have You Got In Your Hand? You can find it for yourself if you Google YouTube BR Furler channel. You can enjoy the beautiful scenery, the sand, the surf and the sun rises. And the teachings from Church on the Beach. I hope you're really blessed. Let me share another scripture that the Holy Spirit has burned in our hearts. It's from Psalm 71, verse 17. O oh God, you have taught me from my youth, and to this day I declare your wondrous works. Verse 18. Now also, when I am old and grey-headed, O oh God, do not forsake me until I declare your strength to this generation, your power to everyone who is to come. It's so much on our heart after many years of Christian service, including pioneering churches and pastoring, mission work and taking teams to over 30 nations of the world, now we are old and grey but want to continue on serving the Lord and finding the internet a wonderful way of doing it. Hey, be inspired if you're old and grey to find a way. And if you're young, we want to impart things that we have learnt over the years to you. 1 Corinthians 4.15 For though you might have 10,000 instructors in Christ, yet you do not have many fathers. We now are not only fathers and mothers, but we are grandparents and have a special care for the children and a greater responsibility for what we do. Another reason for why church on the beach is this. I must refer back to the Word of God that's been our great inspiration. Psalm 96, O oh, sing to the Lord a new song. Sing to the Lord, all the earth. Sing to the Lord, bless His name. Proclaim the good news of His salvation from day to day. Declare His glory among the nations, His wonders among the peoples. For the Lord is great and greatly to be praised. He is to be feared above all gods. For all the gods of the peoples are idols. But the Lord made the heavens. Honour and majesty are before him. Strength and beauty are in his sanctuary. And through beautiful sunrises we declare the glory of God day after day. And let him be glorified in the word of God. Which keeps going forth into the nations. We must keep bringing light to a dark world. Jesus said, I am the light of the world. And he also said, we are the lights of the world. So let your light shine. 
Yes, let your light really shine and glorify your Heavenly Father. So glad that you could join us and uh, God bless you. Have a great day.